of a white mistress. Cause I'm walking around in women's underwear. Jingle hell's bells, kids. Steve coming right back at you. Christmas present time. I'm going to show you first before I open one from another Hollis build and one from Mr. and Mrs. Rademacher, my parents. One I got from Big D. Yes, he sent me a big unit again, which, you know, is expected. Love Big D's big unit. It's a Johnson, don't you know? It's an autographed, right up there. Sorry about the reflection. PSA DNA Certified Authentic Tom Bunk Autograph from Alan and Ginter. Now, if you don't know who Tom Bunk is, please crawl out from under your rock, which is probably under a stool out in the ocean somewhere. He is one of the famed artists for Garbage Pail Kids, right from their inception. He also sent me... The Curious George, which is me, Monkey Fat, autograph card. This was pulled out of a box by somebody. And it's Joe, is that Sitco? I believe is the artist. But that Tom Bunk, holy crap, Merry Christmas, Steve. Let's get into another house build. I hope you are all having a wonderful Christmas time. Having a great, great time with your family, if you do that sort of thing. And if not, with your friends and other loved ones as needed. Alrighty, so from Matt Hollis, candy cane wrapping. It might be a top short print from Holiday, candy cane wrapping. Let's take a look. Oh, it even says Steve. I don't know if that was more for my benefit, so I know it was mine when I got here, or his while he was wrapping it. We may never know. A Christmas miracle. It says Steve on the inside, too. Nice, Matt. Always appreciate you, buddy. As I do all of you. Every one of you out there. I am having trouble getting in. Hmm. <laughs> That's what she said. Dirty Mrs. Claus. Okay. Alrighty, and this, oh, I got, got a little something, something here for the Origami of Folders, whom I will see a little bit later today, and the Little Girl Bridget folder as well, so that's awesome. I will make sure these stay unopened. Please forward to, hey Matt, how about a hand delivery? Is that going to be good enough? I hope so. I won't even look at them or open them or drool on them. Can't promise the same thing for them, though. Alrighty, let us check out this first box here. Well, box, of bag, whatever this is. It's still early. But it is Christmas. We got, ooh, a couple of nice. Burt Blyleven and Jack Morris, Allen and Ginter, Hall of Fame minis, if I'm not mistaken, at least the Morris is a short print. Hey, and I wasn't. They're both short prints, and the Blyleven has the variant front. That's cool. Thank you, Matt. Matt knows I like the original. I like the odd, the ookie, the goofy, and the goopy. But uh, most of all, I enjoy my Hall of Famers. Alrighty, we have, oh, the Topps Gold numbered Andrew McCutcheon. We have Uncle Larry on the Brewers. Oh, nice die cut of Warren Spawn. Now that's super cool. Chris Yelich on Chronicles. <laughs> He's on the Chronic. And, oh, that's cool. Oh, that's numbered. That's a blue-bordered Keston Hira. He knows I like my Milwaukee teams, Brewers, Bucks, Braves. I mean, once in a while, I'll go on to the Green Bay Packers, the Wisconsin Badgers. You name them, I like them. Sorry the G-spot's backwards, but camera tricks. 
Ooh, and he's getting into the spray painting. Check out his shorts. They have thousands upon thousands of views already. Awesome. I got the one of one. Welcome <laughs> to Kansas. There's a little Dairy Queen on it. That's awesome. But yeah, look what that's the kind of work he does. This does not do it justice. Some of you might have already gotten one too. Show yours on camera. The and he's done them, I've noticed in some team colors. I get the blues and stuff, you know, a little bit green for the Brewers and Packers. I've seen some done in yellows and reds and you know, whatever the hell the twins are. But that's awesome. And yes, Matt, this will definitely be hand delivered. I've already got one from Lockin going to him. Got some from some other people as well, so we'll make sure they get that. Now, I'm sorry I'm out of cue, but my mom sent me this. I got this just before Thanksgiving. She said, save it. Don't open it until Christmas. I said, yes, Ma. So, it's Christmas. I think I just cut myself. Okay, not sure why. I had to wait till Christmas. <laughs> oh, that's what I heard. Nice, got air pillows. Love it, love it, love it, love it, love, it. love air pillows. This is stuff I did need is on my Amazon list. That's cool. It, this one here is a humidifier for my bedroom. Man, is it dry up there. Now what do we have? We have a second humidifier because it's dry on the second floor as well. I'm in the basement. Not as bad down here, but could be better. So guys, hey, you don't just need cards, toys, and Legos for Christmas to make it a happy one. This is awesome. I'm going to go mess with these here shortly. But hey, everybody, I'm hoping you all had a great, great weekend. Have an awesome Christmas. Eat lots of food. Watch that football. Have yourself a nice day off tomorrow if your job so gave you one like mine did. And have a great rest of the week. We will be back at you. And I'll just leave you with that. Peace.